Hey everyone, and thanks for jumping back into the Cryptoverse. Today, we're gonna to talk about Bitcoin and we're gonna be looking at the percentage drawdown from the all-time high. If you guys like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and check out the holiday sale on Into the Cryptoverse Premium at intothecryptoverse.com. We do have several different tiers available, so make sure you check that out. Link is in the description below or the pinned comment. We've talked about this chart before quite a lot. I thought it would be somewhat timely to provide an update considering you know, there, there are recent price developments for Bitcoin. One of the things we've talked about is how Bitcoin will often spend you know, a considerable amount of time being down about 65 to 70 percent before realizing that final capitulation down to the market cycle bottom. We saw that back in 2014. We saw it back in 2018. And we've sort of seen it in 2022, although that final capitulation to those lower levels arguably still eludes us. And so now Bitcoin is sort of in, in this range of being 75% down from the all-time high. So it's sort of like in between, right? It's not, it's not at the levels that it was at, at, at in this past summer, but it's also not as far down as it historically goes either. So something to consider is, is or I think something we should really do is continue to watch this as the months go as the months continue to pass us by because if if the months pass us by and you see the percentage drawdown from all-time high for Bitcoin really start to match what you've seen in prior bear markets it, it would be at least a sign that things could finally start to be turning until then I do think it remains fairly useful to remain somewhat conservative in in your approach if you were to switch this over to the total market cap, one of the things you'll notice is that it's only down about 72% from the all-time high, right? It's only down about 72%. Last cycle, the total market cap went down about 87%. And, and I mean, I know the cycle before that, it only went down about you know 78%, but that was also when it was mostly just Bitcoin. This discrepancy here, right? From 72 to 88, compared to 75 to 85 or so is one of the contributing factors, I think, into considering why the dominance of Bitcoin is still poised to make a sustained move to the upside. It's the fact that the altcoin market still has, um, you know, considerable ground that it could easily give up. Another way to, to view that actually is to go take a look at, at Bitcoin USD and, and take a look at how far down it is from the 2019 peak. It's only down about 17% or so. Now look at total two, which is everything besides Bitcoin. So it does include stable coins. It's like 68% down from the, alt, from the 2019 all time high. Now it does include stable coins, so it probably won't make it down at that low, even if Bitcoin does. But it does show you just how much more room there is for the altcoin market to drop uh, than compared to Bitcoin, right? So I, I think it's worthwhile when you when you're navigating the cryptoverse to sort of compare where Bitcoin is, compare it to you know where is the total market cap drawdown, where does that compare to prior cycles, and then you know compare that to things like Ethereum and see where that is, right? Look at where it is this cycle compared to where it was last cycle. Not to say that it has to measure the same distance down of 94%, but is a 75% drop enough? I, I don't really think so, is my opinion. Um, you look at things like Cardano, right? I mean, I mean, look, Cardano spends a lot of its time being down 90 something percent from the all time high. I mean, that's just a fact, right? Don't take it up with me, take it up with the data. And the trends are, are, are certainly pointing in some similar, similar directions. So I think it's worthwhile to continue to follow this. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this, this viewpoint on it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you like the content. And again, check out the holiday sale on Into the Cryptoverse Premium at intothecryptoverse.com. Thank you guys for tuning in. Subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.